Today we're gonna break down two aspects of how Jamie Foy actually holds his front crooks pinched. And then we're gonna go to the skate park and try it out and see if these techniques can help an average skater like you or me learn how to hold front crooks pinched better. So I've done a bunch of videos on front crooks. Today we're just specifically gonna be focusing on two techniques. But first we'll just quickly go over the basics of Jamie Foy's front crook. The first thing you need to know is that Jamie Foy sets up for the front crook like he's almost doing a heel flip. The reason he does that is because when he actually gets into the front crook he hangs his toes off the edge of the nose and that gives him the leverage to actually pinch the grind also when Jamie Foy is rolling up to the front crook he rolls in at the same angle that his board will be in when he's actually locked into the front crook so he doesn't go parallel and then tweak his board he just comes at a slight angle into the ledge ollies puts all the weight on that front foot with the toes hanging off and then once he's in that's when the front crook can get a little bit tweaked out so now that we've covered the basics here are the two aspects that we're going to be covering in this video so the first one is Jamie Foy's bushings Jamie Foy talked on the nine club about how much he loves the thunder conical bushings but specifically he likes the clear blue and the clear red sure they're never I make sure they're never white like the white ones or anything mm. solid color bushings you terrible like the transparent I need the ones blue the blue or the red transparent the dye weird. changes the the whole <laughs> urethane like chemically a little yeah. bit the last time I was trying to learn front crooks I was on some solid green deluxe bushings because the bushings were so big my trucks were super super tight and a lot of you mentioned in the comments that the reason I was struggling to hold the front crook was because my bushings were essentially bouncing me out and then I remember this clip of Jamie Foy talking about how loose his trucks are I skate more on the loose side say if you had a, a scale loose medium tight a little bit looser than medium I feel like the loose trucks kind of help you like land more tricks Hey, like just kind of save more stuff. So to test this, I went ahead and bought a Thunder Truck Rebuild Kit with the clear red bushing that Jamie Foy swears by. Basically, the theory with this is that the front crook pinch is already almost like so delicate and so precise that when you've got a hard bushing creating resistance, it will want to bounce you out of the pinch. Whereas if you have a looser truck with more pliable bushings, it'll allow you to just rest perfectly in that front crook pinch. Now, the second aspect of how Jamie Foy holds his front crooks is very very specific but I believe it's very very important and that is the angle of his foot where his toes are pointing while he's doing the front crook so if you pause on Jamie Foy's pinch when he's fully locked in the front crook if you put like a finish line on the ledge you'll notice that his heel would actually reach that finish line first before his toes and that is because his toes are slightly pointed backwards and this actually makes complete sense because for a backside crook your toes are pointed diagonally forward so that your heel can rest over the right side of the nose and really pinch that crook and with front crooks It's just exactly the opposite you almost lead with your heel and point your toes slightly backwards Diagonally backwards and that gives them the right leverage point to hold on to that front crook If you try to lead with your toes on the front crook or even keep your toes and your heels just parallel to the ledge It will turn more of a nose grind pinched on the wrong side of the truck Which most of the time will just end up with your board rolling off the ledge which is something that I dealt with a lot the last time that I tried this so now that we know these two new aspects of Jamie Foy's front crook pinch it's time to go to the skate park test them out for ourselves and see if they can help an average skater like you or me get a better pinch on front side crooked grinds also real quick I want to give a shout out to wing kick for sending me these dunks they've got to be one of my favorites that I've ever received so thank you so much wing kick
That is by far the most comfortable I've ever felt sitting on a front crook, so I can confirm that these hacks do work. If you like this video, you should check out this one. It's the last front crook video I made with different techniques that Jamie Foy uses for front crooks. Remember to make every single day a Friday, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.